And so then we thought, well, there was always a different group of people and lots of interested people about gardening. Why don't we have a community garden right in the middle of Fremantle? So we brought the mayor down one day and said, this is what we think, we should have a community garden. He said, I've got just the place and it's not going to get vandalised. And <laughs> So that's how this came about. What you see here, have a look around and ask questions. But we have the six year um, rotation of his ideas. And the cafe, Nine Seeds Cafe, have been absolutely wonderful. They've basically just let us use their backyard for a community garden, so we've bypassed all of the, the formal um, council type system. This is private land and we've got a, a lease arrangement. So um, we're really proud of everything we've got up and, and going since then. And um, I think everybody learns on all of these journeys. We make lots of mistakes and we, we don't mind. That means we all learn and we do things differently. And, um, these are eggplants. But most of these things come from Henderson Recycle, from uh, roadside bins and all that sort of thing. And that's how you start off, because this is what permaculture is all about, sustainability. Two heaps of weeds, two shovelfuls of sheep manure, and about a half a bucket like that of seaweed, which you can pick up in a plastic bag when you go to the beach and just bring it home. Do you have to worry about the salt in the seaweed? No. The salt's in the water. Community garden, Hilton Harvest Community Garden. Uh, we've got uh, about 20 allotment garden beds and some communal garden beds as well. It's run by a committee and we're on education department land. And we've got um, a few projects on the go at the moment. We've planted an orchard a little while ago up in this corner. Mm -hmm. And we're building our chook yard um, over here by using um, earthship technology, so okay. it's all built from recycled materials okay. and it will be solar passive so it will be a great house for the chickens. Okay. So that should be made um, within the next few months. Um, yeah, so people pay a fee to come and join the garden for, uh, to have an allotment for the year and they get their water and soil and that kind of thing. Uh, what else can I say? We've got a great um, strong committee, about 10 people who are really actively involved in the garden but a lot of support from the community. It's a great idea though, having the community and the problems. What's up, Mum? Mum, look what I got! Oh, Jazzy, you're a lucky girl, aren't you? But I think that's what you can take. I'm going to save some for other people. Are you ready? So the people on the bikes have just arrived. They're not doing much food for them. Yeah, we are. So it's only well, we can place the key. Oh,
kids do come in here and, and grow things from scratch and are learning about seed saving and all of that stuff. This is also connected to a massive seed bank for Fremantle. So hey.